in front of them. Thanks, Mayor. Um, and uh, deputy senators and, of course, the, all the visitors and the, the, the guests here, I'd like to welcome as well. Um, I think one of the common sentiments that's been expressed around this chamber uh, uh, numerous times is uh, fear and anger at the fact that politics in this country is held in a very low esteem. Uh, um, and I think the events of the past two weeks um, just go to show why. Uh, uh, and unfortunately, we have furthered that. We've had our, our very own, uh, uh, we've had alternative facts from Limerick's own bargain basement, Donald Trump, defended, let's not forget, defended numerous times in multiple local and national media outlets over, over the course of a week. A, a half-hearted apology, I have to say, uh, um, in order to, and I'll come to why, in, in order simply to, in, it, it looks to me, to save somebody's political skin. Uh, um, and let's call it what it was. What was said wasn't just uh, um, offensive to some people who are, are sensitive. Uh, um, what was said was completely and utterly untrue. It was designed to cause, to whip up racism, to scapegoat immigrants for the health and housing crises that have been caused by the austerity policies supported by Fianna Fáil, Fine Gael and Labour. Um, so what I would call for is, is not just a half-hearted apology if you, you offended somebody, Mayor, but I'd call for you to retract the comments completely and to admit that actually what you said was untrue. Uh, 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 um, uh, and not just offensive, but completely untrue, that the health and housing crises have gotten worse at a time when emigration over, is greater than immigration, that the health and housing crises are not caused by immigrants, that they are in fact caused by politics, by successive governments underfunding our health and housing services, find, uh, giving more funding to the banks and developers then to, to, the, to those essential public services. So I'd call, if that apology is, is, is genuine, then not a half-hearted apology if, but actually hold your hands up and say that what you said was itself offensive, untrue, and that you completely and utterly retracted. Congratulations on your innovation today. Um, for a moment for you and your family.